Alright YouTube, this is Mr. Donut Will 13 back again with another MUT13 video. Uh, I'm here back doing the uh, left guard positional collection today. And I'm particularly excited because as you can see there, it's a Patriot. And uh, I already know it's Logan Mankins, just, look <clears throat> just looking at it. I haven't even looked at the card reward because that, uh, I just wanted to surprise myself with him. So, um... Yeah, I'm just really happy. Uh, I'm going to have to get an extra one because I need one for my All-Pats team. Um, but that really excites me. I've only spent about 50, oh, 50 something grand. 50 grand. I'll just say 50 grand on this collection. Why? Because, ladies and gentlemen, I had all three legends. I had this Evan Mathis. I had that IU Potty. I had everybody for this collection that I needed. Um, except for a few bronzes and rookies and, uh, maybe a few silvers as well. Anyway, um, yeah, really excited to see this card, so, nice looking card, two star. Oh my goodness, what a boss. Wow, I'm really happy. <laughs> um... The, those are great stats. Um, he basically, we, this is pretty amazing to say, um, but it's true that he's replacing my Gene Upshaw, who, by the way, is like also one of the maybe one of the oldest cards in this game. But two-star Gene Upshaw is also still one of the best left guards. So, guys, if you, uh, um. What was I going to say? If you want to get a good left guard for pretty cheap, and it's not going to be Logan Mankins, two-star Gene Upshaw. I believe he's only going for about 20 grand. Um, so that's really it there. Anyway, um, let's throw him in actives. I'm doing this collection pretty fast, um, so I'm not going to cut it short at 219 because, ladies and gentlemen, um, they're not going to show it, but there is a happy hour going on this weekend. Um, and I don't know if I'll post it during that weekend, but um, I'm starting to pull packs right now. Um, I don't know if there's a uh, RG3 left in the packs, but they did release a golden ticket RG3. There's only three of them, and wow, there's already Daryl Washington in my pack. I'm just pulling cards like crazy. Um, looking out for some rare golds. Like I know everyone gave me crap about discarding um, that. Uh, left outside linebacker Anthony Spencer, um, but <laughs> I don't know. I didn't see him, I guess, and uh, he just kind of skipped over, and I discarded him. Um, so I'm, I'll try not to make that mistake again, but... I believe there's only one or two left of the uh, GT... Golden ticket, uh, what's it called? Um, Jaguars receiver, can't think of his name. Oh my god, I just pulled Evan Mathis again. Um, ladies and gentlemen, this card is worth like 300 grand. Um, holy crap, I can't believe I just did that. That is awesome. Well, this pack, this collection is definitely paid off. I have, I'm so happy right now. That's my phone going off. Um, oh my goodness. And, um, yeah, YouTube, um, I'm, I'm just happy to be doing this recording right now, um, because I got this collection done pretty quickly, so, yeah. Um, let's see, what else can I get? Um, oh yeah, I'm looking for a gold... Uh, look, uh, Jeff Allen, he's worth about 10k because I had to buy him, so, <laughs> he was a bummer, but, I'm going to take a chance and discard him, I don't think he's worth anything, um, I know they've released the Vaughn back into packs even though they said they wouldn't, um, ever again, <laughs> which is kind of funny, but, um, it's okay. Um, I think a lot of people are happy that they're 
be releasing the collection cards for people to finish those collections. Uh, me and myself, I only need a uh, uh, two collections to do, then I have all of the positional collections done. One is the MLB number two. Pull the Chad Greenway. I'm going to throw him in reserves. I have no idea how much he's worth. Um, I have all of the fantasies except the Vaughn for uh, the left outside linebacker. I'm um, kind of hoping they go up, but they never really pulled him from packs. So um, maybe they'll go up right now because Vaughn's back. So I don't know. I'll just, I'm just going to hold on to him just in case. But um, Four packs left and all reveal. Yeah, you can see I'm doing a lot of reveal all right now. Um, Eric Olsen isn't worth much. He's worth actually he's worth 5k. Um, I'm gonna spread the wealth and uh, make try to drop him in price because I know people don't want to spend that much on some of those low level cards like that. Um, I'm gonna hold on to him. Um, oh yeah, I remember his name now. Justin Blackman. Um, Yeah, I really want him. I know there's only one or two left uh, out, and there probably isn't even RG3s out. <laughs> uh, there might be one, but uh, like uh, they said, RG3s are numbered to three, guys. So extremely rare there. Fine guy, I know is worth nothing. Oh, there's a... Uh, they also released all the most feared cards. Personally, I really like those cards. Um, I thought they looked cool. And um, they're worth a pretty good chunk of coin, so I'm going to throw that in my actives. But and I've already filled my actives. Don't know how much that Kellen Winslow is going for. I'm sure he's going for plenty um, with the uh, all the tight ends out. Um, I sold a Jimmy Graham fantasy uh, card for 5K today, guys. Um, that's how cheap he is. So... They're really doing work on this happy hour. And there is Jared Allen. Oh, my goodness. All right, that's a good one to have. Um, I know that collection's worth a lot. So, um, actually, I'm going to revolve first. Well, Jared Allen, it, wow. This, If I bought eight packs, they would have been paid off. Um, that's how good these packs are right now, guys. Um, I'm going to keep pulling packs and working on uh, just doing some collections um, that are pretty old, those, specifically those um, uh, most feared cards. Um, I would like to also be able to do that uh, in Tony, or not Tony Gates, um, the Week 10 Fantasy Collection because they put those... Uh, uh, Jimmy Graham's to pretty cheap, so uh, maybe I'll be able to do that. Troy Aikman, for some reason, got really rare. Not sure why. But I'll, so I'm going to hold, definitely hold on to him. Um, I know there's a QB collection possibly, but I, didn't, I really don't care. I've got my favorite QB in the game, um, not personally, but uh, to play with uh, is Joe Montana. Um, I like to be able to take off people by uh, eluding from their uh, guy and or from their rusher, and that really makes them mad, especially when I can complete the pass right after. So you can see my key pack was Matt Forte. I don't know. I don't think I have him, so uh, it's kind of nice to have for the halfback possible halfback collection. I don't know if it'll happen, but. Um, thanks you two for watching and stay tuned for my upcoming videos and um, Yeah, that's really it guys. So till next time um, Peace out